Greetings my Zodiac children, it's uh, Zodia here and I'm going to do a quick customizing his magic video. I've been getting quite a few comments on my first two and well, they're really popular. My first one is actually my third most popular video and so I decided to make another one. This is not love song, obviously, it is another pony. If you can guess who this is, then thumbs up. Pause the video right now, go down in the comments, and well, guess who this is. Right now, okay? You should be done by now, because you're supposed to pause the video. But this is Philly Princess Celestia, young Princess Celestia. I've already got her body painted, but her hair is not painted. I tried to turn her head, but her hair broke. I had to glue back together. I don't know if you can tell, but there was a big old crack, like, right there, and it fell off. And so did this tip right here. And for some reason, her tail fell off, too. But I already coated her body with spray paint, but unfortunately, that didn't exactly work out because there are quite a few spots that need touch-ups on my hooves, her legs and stuff and her horn got burnt so yes her horn, her wings, and her hair are all made out of clay I made her out of a Twilight Sparkle that I got at Walmart for about $5 I have, I have the paint I'm gonna need here white for her body and to mix with the pink and after I'm done with that and the first coat of I may have to put a couple different of pink plain pink coats on her hair but after I do that I'm going to add a glittery light pink coat and right now I'm just gonna do her body I may make another part to this video they will be two separate videos because movie makers being stupid and I can't put two videos together Together. Nor can I add music to my speed paint, so that's why, in case you were wondering. Let's see, I'm going to put my paint on this piece of paper here. Well, this is a little trick I learned to help me not waste paint. Instead of pouring out a big glob of white paint, because I'm not mixing right now, just open the bottle and put your paintbrush right in there. It really helps. I hope this turns out kind of smooth, but if it doesn't, then, well, yeah, all that spray paint was wasted. <laughs> I emptied out a can of spray paint on this because the coats, I put too much on at once on the first coat, but yeah. And I have been getting a little bit of hate on my singing on my first Customizing His Magic. So I'm not sure if I'm going to sing in this one or not. If you hate it, mute the video. If you love it, then don't mute the video. <laughs> I think I got someone that says, OMG, shut up girl, shut up singing and put on some real music. <laughs> I replied to it earlier. They have this little argument going on, and well, frankly, I think I'm going to win it. <laughs> I love winning arguments. It's so much fun. After you get good at it, gosh, that's it's fun winning arguments. I have to agree with you on that one, Milo. It's really fun. And if you're wondering why I decided to make Celestia instead of Luna, it's because Luna's too overrated. I like her and all, she's nice and she's pretty and stuff, but she's overrated. She's the most popular character in the fandom and don't you deny it. Celestia gets absolutely nothing and, well, Luna gets everything. I think this is just like the origin story of Nightmare Moon, but reversed. Luna's the popular one. Celestia is the one being ignored. I get, t I'm getting kind of tired of it. I like Celestia. 
Twilight might be my favorite pony and princess, but I still really like Celestia. And I get sick and tired of all the Luna stuff everywhere. Oh, and by the way, Milo, before I got kicked off, I saw that anti-Luna stamp you made. The one that says Loon Princess Luna is not that special. Psh, I agree with you. 100% with on that. Gosh, Luna is way too overrated. I'm not hating on her or anything, but I'm just expressing my opinion. Okay, you won't have to hear me sing. If you want to hear me sing, listen to my cover of The Moon Rises. I didn't do it because I love Luna and she's better than every pony else. I did it because it was a really pretty song and I've been wanting to make a cover of it for like ever. It will not hurt your ears. Like some of my other covers will. <laughs> my first try at Lullaby for a Princess, phew, gosh awful. And this is gosh darn awful. Second cover of Lullaby for a Princess. Not as bad, but still pretty bad. Instead of saying, But such is the way of the limelight it sweetly. Okay, I know I said you wouldn't have to hear me sing, but that was just one line. This is what I accidentally said in that cover. But such is the way of the limelight. It so easily takes hold of the mind of its host. The moon rises turned out pretty good. The fox turned out pretty good. All the other ones turned out pretty good. Oh, and by the way, if you have any requests for covers or anything, just comment on one of my covers or on this video right now because I will most likely do them if I like the song and if it's clean. Oh, and if you're wondering what I'm doing right now, it's just a really neat technique. You can take your finger and lightly run it over wet paint and it makes it really smooth. It thins the coat and you get paint like all over your finger, but oh well, it makes it smooth. And it looks really good. Yeah, I'm going to have to make another one for, I'm going to, put, I'm probably going to put another coat or two of white on Celestia here, but I'm not going to record it. And with her hair, I'm going to make some separate videos for her hair. I'm not sure, I cannot find the other parts to my love song customizing is magic, and even if I could, well, I couldn't piece them together in Windows Movie Maker. So, yeah, the, that one probably won't be finished, but, and I didn't begin this one. I should have started with the spray painting and the sculpting, but, nope, I'm starting with the hand painting, with the brush stuff. This lo actually looks really good. Her head isn't twistable. I tried. Everything broke. But, yeah. This custom looks really, really nice. I love how it looks. The inside of Ralph there. Yeah, I'm gonna have to put another coat or two, probably. Oh, and Spirit Dancer? Here's a little bit of advice for you with the Zodiac custom and any other glow in the dark customs you do. First, put on a normal base coat of the color and then go over it with the special paint. And it'll just make it easier. Either way, thank you all for watching. And I guess I'll see you next time.